We're about to get into it. Dude, my grandma's the best. She's 98 years old. And she is a true original gangster. Like, she's killed people. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> she's a sweet old lady. She's very nice. <laughs> Braves fan. Impressive. Born in 1922, actually, well, in, yeah. She's old as dirt. It's fun, it's fun to ask her questions about stuff. Like, uh, she, she tells me about, like, how an ice man used to, before there were refrigerators, the ice man would come. It sounds scary, but... <laughs> The Iceman would come bring you a big block of ice that you'd put in your, your ice box. It was just like, you just, every like, I don't know how often, but you'd just get a big block of ice. And that's how you kept your food. You didn't have a refrigerator. It wasn't electric. It was just a big ice cube. I'm not MLG. Thank you for the prime. Thanks, pa pal. Thanks, pan. <laughs> Don't <laughs> I'm not ML MLG is sitting there just like don't call me pen <laughs> don't call me pen I am a pen <laughs> no you're not I'm just stupid and can't talk <laughs> Val Kilmer was the best Iceman agreed he was also the best villain in fucking <clears throat> uh, MacGruber you guys ever see MacGruber Incredible film. Aldine, thank you for the sub. Thanks, pal. Nope. Verge, I'm done playing your little game. Val Kilmer in Heat. Val Kilmer in Batman! <laughs> what a versatile little actor. Jay... Jayowski. Appreciate the prime. Actually, um, you guys have seen my Val Kilmer, uh, photo, right? I will show you. I feel like if your profession is Iceman, you have to know that isn't going to be a lengthy career. Here, check it out. You want to see Val Kilmer? Really? Remember nice, the right? Rate. <laughs> what a strange room. <laughs> Thank you, David. <laughs> yes, it is a strange room. But let me tell you this. Uh, speaking of strange room, I'm going to record a little uh, room tour video. Uh, might go on the second channel, might go on the main channel. I don't know. Depending on how good it comes out, I guess. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I will, Snoo. I plan to. But yeah, it'll be on YouTube. Operator, thank you. Um, I will remember. Thank you very much. Cheers. This is water, not gin. Yeah. Salty Sierra, thank you for the seven months. Silent, good to see you. Thank you for the uh, donation. <laughs> Iceman, yeah, I know, right? Jay Wowski, uh, Aldine, thanks again for the subs, you guys. All right, shall we uh, jump into the game here? House tour? I don't want to do a whole house tour. Oh, thank you, Gregory. You don't have to lie, but, you know, thanks. Glaze it. Oof. Bad gambler. Bathroom tour? I have a really... We have a really ugly bathroom that we want to redo. Perhaps I can show you that. It's where I actually take my uh, bowel movements. I... Just because it's close to this room. That's, uh... Yeah. Do you guys have, like, a designate... Like, if you have more than one bathroom, do you have a designated bathroom that you like to uh, defecate in, specifically? 
bed tour. <laughs> I we do have a low bed, like a low. It's kind of interesting. Yeah, everybody has a preference which bathroom you take a shit in if you have more than one. You know. <laughs> Good for you, Wellen. <laughs> uh, in high school, I had a similar... Like, I had certain bathrooms in high school that in an, in an emergency situation, I would use. Most of the time, I just tried to hold it till I got home, but, you know. Did I miss the tour? No, 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 Echo. I'm gonna be making a video. Poop reveal? That's right, Wellen, yeah. <coughs> Don the hat, it's your work uniform as to defecating the one in the hall sharing is caring. Well, let me tell you something about this here hat. This here hat is a hat for a real cowpoke. A real cowboy. You know? Not just anyone can wear a hat like this, you know? Um, this hat? This here hat? Is for real cowboys only. Now, let me ask you something. Are you guys real cowboys? <laughs> Mindless Gore, thank you for the four months. Can I get a yeehaw in chat? A howdy, mister. Howdy, mister. One of those. Howdy, mister. Howdy, howdy, mister. Fuck. Sorry. Um. Good, all right. Sounds, seems like everybody's ready. All right, let's play. <laughs> good. I'll shut up now. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, Corinne. Kerwin. Kerwin. Howdy, partner. I don't want I don't want to tab out while it's loading. That could maybe something bad might happen. Actually, the last time we played this, I'm pretty sure we crashed the game <laughs> or the game like froze or something and that's when the stream ended. But yeah, you know, you know. Hopefully it works. <laughs> Dr. Duncan, thank you for the sub, pal. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Salty Sierra, thanks again for the seven months, partner. Thank you. That loaded so quickly. Yes, it did. What a badass. Howdy, mister. Hello, mister. Hello, mister. Mm -hmm. It's a cop. A Hello. bobby. Hey there. Hey there, mister. All right. Where to? Gents. Oh, you get good guy points for saying hello. Hello, ma'am. Oh, how do you do? Oh, sorry, mister. Where's my horse? Where's Grave Digger? Rob someone? Okay, relax, Joe. I don't know if you know, Joe, but I'm a good cowboy now. Look at that. Look at that rep wheel. Okay, you see that? And only a, uh, 
$5 bounty or something. I'm a good boy, okay? I am not a bad man. Those days are over. Look, I say hi to everybody. Bonjour, madame. Yes. Bonjour. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Okay. This is definitely New Orleans. We came to that conclusion. Look at this. This is real, pr real purdy. Let's get going. Let's go see Dutch. Douchebag Dutch. Just kidding. I love Dutch. <clears throat> To split hairs, David, honestly. <laughs> Kevin! Hey, can I go to the bathroom? I know the stream just started, but I drank a lot of coffee and water today. <laughs> Don't even say the thing. I'll be right back. Sorry. Howdy, misters. I'm back. Sorry. How long ago did Aqua start streaming? About 20 minutes ago. There Welcome. You, you boys ready? Of course. What else do you know about this guy? Not much, just see some slick little greasy haired European clearly got power money. Oh shoot. Did it not save? Cause the game crashed. <sighs> I did magic mic. Oh, ah fuck. We go in there. Hold on. It it so remember at the end of last stream the it crashed. <sighs> yeah. Didn't save. Damn, that sucks. All right, well, we'll we'll just. It was just this one miss mission, wasn't it? Wait, fuck. Wait, didn't I like chase that kid around and everything too? Oh man, I did quite a bit of stuff. Not that I guess. Shit, that sucks. Better like this. You're gonna have a lot of protection. No one gonna get shot, Arthur. So everyone. That was before. Okay. Okay. Good. Trust me. I think this might have been the last thing we did, actually. That's okay. This was a fun mission. It was cool. We'll just have fun. J Train, thank you for the seven months. What's the most useless talent I have? Probably juggling. <laughs> Although it's great for impressing women and parties Excuse tricks. Me, sir. We have an appointment to see Mr. Bronte. Who are you? You get your boss down here and now so we can talk about this. Yeah, that and bore out impressions for sure. Huh. Run along now, boy. How long have you been streaming? We just turned it on. 
You missed nothing. In fact, the game didn't Charmer save, so we already did this relax. last last time. Skateboarding, <laughs> debatable. It's good exercise, though. Thanks, Braves fan. Yeah, this is the recap. Thank you, Braves fan. Appreciate the four months, partner. We just need to straighten a couple of things out with your boss. Cute hat. Thank you, Mister. You only lost one mission, and so your woman philandering is finishing only juggling for your wife now. True. Grave robbers? You think he's She does love it when I juggle. Oh, it's the only way what I ever can get any uh None, I guess. I think so. Pretty Let's sure just concentrate on the game. It's real <laughs> impressive. You know, you did good holding your tongue in there. Do you trust one word that comes out of that bastard's mouth? We don't even know. Get where yourself Jack a nice is. car, you'll see. Listen, we found Bronte. Hmm. We got in there. Dutch is with him now. All things considered, it could have gone a lot worse. That poor kid. Are women impressed by him. cars? I'm, I don't know. Maybe. He's okay. That, yeah, He'll karate. Yeah. I figure the Braithwaite's were going to hold Jack Branson for all the money we cost him. We must have sent him here so we couldn't get to him. But Bronte knows by now there's no Braithwaite's Obscurity, to thank you for the 18 Jack months. Thank you, partner. Anymore. Thanks for the long time Let's sub. Get this done. Don't talk the about Dutch my little hat. This is a real cowboy's hat. Right. Completely real and authentic. Let's not talk about the size, how big, okay. or how small the hat is. is. Keep it down. Let's hitch your horses up ahead. My wife could care less about cars. Same. Whoa. I don't think, uh... Should go on foot from here, Arthur. Hey, I just want to hit hitch. Grave well, digger. At size? Um. No. No. People tell me, uh. This, this right. hat looks very good. Doesn't matter. Sped Snaz, thank you for the two months. Come on. Thank you. Find him and get the hell out of here. Shoot. Dogs, man. Dogs are so good. Very oh, cool, Mr. Owen. <laughs> Very cool. Indeed. You must be. Thank you for the prime. I love names like that. <laughs> I'm very easily pleased. Good good shit, Owen. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I had a bit to drink. Our friend died. Sorry, par sorry, partner. I've been in this cemetery. Oh, who is that? Oh my god, a wraith, a phantom. I saw the Conjuring 3 um, trailer today. Anybody see that? Trailer, trailer was weak. The trailer for the Conjuring 2 was much better. Bubble Master, thank you for the two months. Thanks for the entertainment. Oh, 
Thank you, partner. Much obliged. Thank you, mister. I think I found these guys much faster last time. I don't remember where they were, though. Nice hat. Thank you. Lead me to the grave robbers, drunk man. Oh, John is standing over by them. Why am I so stupid? Just get out of here, mister. It ain't safe. Oh wait, no he's not. I like this music. This. I know, but you won't care once we get the boy back. Right, we're trying to get Jack back, that's right. broke. Well, thank you for the bit, Exile. You don't need to donate, though. Just enjoy the stream, dude. Peter Pueblo Del Taco. Thank you. Yeah, yeah.
do this because I did it so bad last time. If you can escape, please. Crazy chase before it was ridiculous. I'm I'm actually glad I got to redo it. Well, Thank you, Silent. Appreciate it, pal. Right Justice, thanks for the two man. months. That was you cool. Right? Good that mission. Good mission. He almost certainly is. I want to wipe Vector. Well, I still play from time to time when I feel yeah. like it, but I'm not gonna force it. How's he even gonna know we did what he asked? I got a feeling most things around here get back to him pretty fast. Come on, Arthur. Hey, thank you. Just... My word, love you, man. Thank you, Silent. Very much well, appreciated, dude. You thank you, thank time. you. Where's your host? Very generous, pal. It. Oh, you look. Your time. Ah. I'm glad to see you. Let's get going. What a fine man. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Silent. Yeah, Vector, today. thanks again, pal. I like to play other games, you know, and when Tarkov's feeling a little stale, that's what I'm gonna to do, a you know? Party at the mayor's house. <laughs> oh, the mayor! And us, just simple country boys. All right, good stuff. Let's go. We have a new camp set up, Jack. You're gonna love it. Actually, I think that the game crashed during that mission. So uh, this this all is right. fine, no big deal. Let's get this boy back. Because this is all new. You sure you're okay, son? I'm fine. Papa Bronte said you'd come for me. I'm I'm sorry. What for? For that. For taking so long. I had a fun time. I had my own room with a big bed and a toy box and lots of books. Did they do anything to you? Have you ever had spaghetti? What? What's that? Spaghetti? It looks like worms, but it's delicious. Is that right? Papa Bronte teach me lots of Italian words. Don't oh, call that's him cool. that, please. You know, cavallo? That means horse. I thought it was caballo. Maybe in Italian it's that's a caballo. Slipper. A slipper? They gave me two pairs. One for day and one for night. Well, uh, I'm just glad you're all right. Bene. Oh, yes. But I can't wait to see Mama. Did she miss me? She sure did. Like you wouldn't now, know. Now, after you're done living with a wealthy Italian, come back to our Real dirty camp you, where you Jack. have to live outside <laughs> and have no spaghetti. <laughs> no spaghetti, no slippers, no table. toys. Uncle Welcome Uncle home, Bronte kid. <laughs> Just Mr. Bronte. Uh, yeah. Me and your pa deal with him. I told him you would. Wait you get you Chef Mari Boyardee if you're lucky, kid. Not one. Only stew well, and gruel. Yeah. House. Whatever the nice fuck Mr. Pearson Tom makes. Mind you. Some sort of That's mystery okay. meat. We'll get you what is this, meat? Up in no time. Oh, Pearson? I had a bath last night. <sighs> of course you did. Man, Jack would have been better off. Then he wouldn't turn into a gruff cowboy in Red Dead 2. Or 1. Red Dead 1. Hey, they're back. I think I see Jack. Abigail! Abigail! Oh, they have a house. 
house now. I we forgot. Got you, your son, That's right. Everything. We got him. Mama. He's fine. Red I'm Dead Three fine, Jack Mama. story. That would be cool. They said he was good. Italian. <laughs> Although, um, I feel like at that point, it's already like almost 1920, and I feel like the cowboy lifestyle like died out then. I don't know if they could. It's getting real late in the timeline. How long, how long were there cowboys? Is anyone an expert on American cowboy history? Not really the West. Yeah. Uh, Zoopy, thank you for the two months. Mystery soups, indeed. Jack goes to World War I. Interesting. Interesting. you ever eat that? Come here, you silly boy. Ah. <laughs> you got him. You got my son back. Dutch, Arthur, thank you. Thank you. The cheese. Thanks for the prime partner. Much obliged. I got my son Releasing back. Releasing in the Jack, 1910s. Jack, yeah, Jack. yeah. I think How Red you, Dead boy? 1 takes I'm place sorry, in 1911, thanks. doesn't okay it? Now. Abigail? Can I go play now? <sighs> so, well... We met Mr. Bronte. He is, uh, quite a character. Is he now? You ever meet an Italian strong man before? <laughs> Not outside of a circus. Well, let me tell you all about him. John, you go be with your family. Arthur, thank you. Boys, we got some work to do. Interesting work. But first, let's have a drink. <laughs> we got Jack back! <laughs> well, the boy's safe, thank goodness. Man, thank you, Arthur. I'm... I don't know how to say it. Thank you. I understand. Come on. Do as Dutch says. <clears throat> Go be with your family. Arthur needs a haircut, maybe. All right, fuck parties. I'm going to bed. Actually, I can't turn down a party. I mean, this looks pretty fun. Uncle's drunk as fuck. How about a song? Javier, play us away. This kid, Jack, is like, this sucks. I want to go back to the Italian guy's house. He's got spaghetti. Spaghetti? Have you guys ever had spaghetti? Spaghetti is very good. Better than whenever fucking Pearson's making. I'm gonna grab a drink, damn it. Who's this? Kieran. Loitering suspiciously. Oh, he's the O'Driscoll guy. Yeah. I'm just trying to give you all your moment. Wow, very kind. Hey, yes, uh, Azzy. Thank you for the nine months. Closer and closer. Thank you, man. Appreciate you sticking around. Appreciate the sub, dude. Thank you. How drunk can you get in this game? Trying to go out with with Lenny in New Orleans. Arthur's taking his sleeping medicine, as I like to call it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. Can I play a little? 
He's dressed like a little Italian child now. Well, I'll let you find folks get reacquainted. Party time. <laughs> Arthur looks fucked up. You what? Here you are. Eat up. Thanks. I think so. Fuck off, Pearson. Sure. So I got caught doing. You okay, Pearson? Yes, indeed. Feels like we can move forward again. I hope so. I was just worried, sick. Hello. This isn't really. Eh, yeah, kind of. Okay, Mama. Sorry it ain't spaghetti. For a Get chicken. some drinks down, you. Live a little. I might have a couple. This is a party. Ooh, man. Boring bastard. You okay, Sadie? Sure. You boys did good. Well, we got lucky this time. Lenny! Where's Lenny? I gotta find Lenny. <laughs> gonna say hi to Lenny and then I'm going to bed. <laughs> Lenny! Well, fair enough. <laughs> there he is. Come on. You know, me and you should go get some drinks and say yeah. ah! sometime. <laughs> I ain't sure that's a good idea. <laughs> ah, come on. It was one bad time. <laughs> Lenny! Well, uh, can't think of anything else to say. Sure. Well, they ran out of writing there. Okay, let's go. We're going to bed. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah. All right. How you doing? You're in a good mood. Yep. Oh, wrong way. Arthur's room over here. I was thinking maybe it would be a little easier for me to keep an eye on him if we all stayed together. You know, my room. You mean like a normal family? Look around you. Ain't nothing normal about any of this. Yeah, I got that. What is all this? It's got a million supplies and rifles and cool. All right. Let's have stuff in my room. Looking clean. Time to go to bed. Uh, sleep. I'm stealing from myself. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna sleep till. Let's sleep in. We're gonna sleep till noon and then get back to business. Cowboy business. You do be dripping. I know. Arthur's got some nice fucking clothes. We did a good job on his look. Don't you guys think? What chapter are you in? Uh, we're in St. Denis. I don't know which chapter it is. Alright. What's this? My dear Arthur, 
I hope this letter finds you well. I wanted to thank you for your help with Jamie. He and Daddy are still arguing. When your cap is well maintained, you get little that bonus Jamie's loot thinking about going just back to my eye. Thank you, Whatever Silent. Happens, I believe yeah, I figured. Saved his life, and we are all thank truly you, thank you. grateful. Oh, Arthur. I have made such a mess of my life time and again. Why can I not change and be the woman I want? How does be? she know where to send these Why letters? You change? <laughs> it's you a mailman like put down all those fantasies that shroud your judgment. Life is very confusing. Oh, you mean the And I see now that I'm Outlaw not very Cowboy good at Hideout. It. Sure, I know where that I'm is. I'm afraid we've got ourselves into another mess. It's not my fault, but I need your help. That moves around every ten seconds. Yeah. Oh, Arthur. I know it is wrong to ask you, but I have nobody else. And for what we once had together, <laughs> I beg of you, even though I am ashamed to do so. Yours, Mary. You collect at the post office? Okay, okay, yeah. Colorblind, thank you for the 22 months. Hello, hello. Thank you for the almost two years, Colorblind. It's good to see you. And you know the answer to that question. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Alrighty. Alright. I think I do have to go help Mary. I'd imagine it's a main mission. Yeah. Oh. Are you having trouble with the Chelonians again? How have you been, Arthur? Okay. You seem well, Reverend. Yes. Well, maybe. I've been okay before, but then I make a fool of myself again. <laughs> so do I. I went into town. <laughs> Shut so up. So did I. If I was still a, a religious man, I'd say there are too many Catholics there, but I've I've given up on all that. Mm. Me too, Reverend. I met a monk there. Kindly fellow. Took me back to my days in college. Is there any purpose to this conversation, Reverend? I'm wondering really, the same thing. But he said the strangest things about all manner of bad things happening in town. Bad things happening in a city. <laughs> Who would have thought it possible? Maybe if you're there, you could have a chat with him. He's hanging about outside the marketplace, collecting alms for the poor. Sounds thrilling. All right, Reverend. All right, what's up, Hosea? Hosea? Hey, Arthur. Come on! If we're gonna make it to this party, sure Dutch is shit, so like, oh. we're doing this. Oh, yeah. Old friend Dutch Vandal uh, is finally showing his true colors. Wait, is Dutch voiced by that politician who was like, <laughs> and everybody he kind of has the same flair to his voice. You know, he's a real yeah. social climbing. <laughs> Old Senor Bronte, that horrendous snake, has invited us to Howard the Dean. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So my suggestion is we go and get you <laughs> down. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Utterly. Mm -hmm. I ain't never been to a ball in my life. Nor have this is I, good. if I am being honest. I used to quite Arthur, often. you couldn't palm I aid? Jesus I, Christ. No, 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 no pickpocketing. We are here to make real contact. I would have got a haircut. I don't know. If I knew this was coming, I would have got a fucking haircut. Jesus Christ. We'll find what we can. All I know for sure is we are going to a party at the mayor's house, and the guest of honor is the worst crook the in town. The bad. I'm sure <laughs> that we will find some. Okay. <laughs> Gentlemen, Luca. Look at that hat. I'm afraid the mayor does not allow guns at official functions. Dutch is after dripping last like crazy. Look. 
Luca here will take you to Mr. Hey, Wolf. Thank you. What a mugging. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Mr. Bronte, I believe he is expecting you. Oof, what a mugging. Follow me, gentlemen. This way, please, gentlemen. A senior Bronte will be so pleased that you made it. We are honored to be here. <laughs> That's wonderful, wonderful. That. Come, come, this way. Uh, what a beautiful evening it shall be. Mr. Brante is a very good friend with I look man. like a Geico caveman. I love the roast the duck with a mango so, salsa. Know, Mr. Brante, he Remember that commercial? Thing, you know, uh, respect. Jose, well, Bill, you join the party. We'll meet you out back after we pay our respects to Senor Brante. <laughs> Salutations, gamer. Hello. When you're done. The hair needs pomade, and we'd look fine. We'd look good. Nice house. <laughs> Dear Captain, thank you for the three months. This hat is perfect. Boys, you arrived. Thanks, pal. And you've washed for the prima volta questo mese senza dubbio. Oh, <laughs> this is quite a party you've invited us to. Yes, quite something. Although I'm not quite sure what. <laughs> so, this is Sandini High Society. Yes, apparently so. And all these people, these are friends of yours, <laughs> Senor Bronte. No, 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 not quite, not quite. But they certainly are afraid of me. Like that one. See that <laughs> Are there He's bites of the cigar? <laughs> Only I do that mule. when I smoke them. <laughs> You'll do anything for a dollar, and I mean anything. Politics is a foul business. Yes. Oh, and that one too. That is Alberto Fuzar. He owns a sugar plantation out on the island. Russian, thank you for the prime. To her in this I am tired today, <laughs> Russian. But thanks for the prime, man. Oh, oh, and that... <laughs> I, I do like a cigar myself once that in a while. That is Hobart Crowley, a, a Confederate major in the war. I mean, hero, they say, but that, this is his very young wife. I mean, a young mistress, that's the natural order of things. Yes, but a young wife is unseemly. Oh, oh, the Redskins. <laughs> I have no sympathy for them, because whoever is stupid enough to get tricked by the Americans, no, they get what they deserve, huh? <laughs> yes, and a letter to the mayor. Oh, yeah, that'll save you. Is that the mayor? <laughs> and that... That is Hector Fellows. Mm. This self-righteous newspaper man. Maybe, maybe you will kill him for me one day. <laughs> well, we're not paid killers as such. Not in cold blood, anyway. I did not know you were so particular that uh, you wouldn't help a friend. Oh, I'm willing to help in any way I can, uh, within reason. <laughs> I'm going to pretend to understand what that means. I meant no offense, sir. I'm not taken. None taken! <laughs> <laughs> All these vulgar people. They hate me. <laughs> non vedo l'ora di guardarti morire. <laughs> well, uh, it has been wonderful conversing with you, but I can tell that you are very busy and I won't waste any more of your time. Yes, yes, yes. Go, enjoy yourselves and mingle with this vulgar scum. It'll make you long for the days when you could shoot each other and screw cows out on the open range. <laughs> Those sure were the days. Good day, gentlemen. Mm, good day to you. But before you go, what uh, exactly are your plans here? Well, we've not made any... Well, we are going to need some money. Money, yes, of course. But there's, there's money at the trolley station. They keep a lot of cash there in the day. Now, I could not involve myself in such uh, matters. But you... Pff, as a guest, yes. As my guest, <laughs> yeah, Dutch is pissed. It, huh? <laughs> okay, good day, gentlemen. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> okay, ragazzi, adesso il vino buono. Sì. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you to the party, gentlemen, if you'll kindly follow me. Hmm, what's in that room? Are we gonna rob this guy? I feel like we're gonna rob this guy. That'll be cool. <laughs> Bill, don't, no spoilers, please. Enjoy your evening.
Thank you for the four months. Once again, to ciao, ciao. Oh, on the Autobahn? Oh, shit. That sounds scary. <laughs> Be careful, dude. Let's go ingratiate ourselves. Oh, my God. Well, Phil, thank you for the four months. So cool. Can I help you, sir? Well, I'm not quite sure. Albert Danielson. This is Mr. How was the show? I heard you. Alright, I gotta find the mayor, huh? Makes you look like a hobo by comparison. I know. I just need a little hair pomade and I'd look good. I, I didn't realize I was going to a party. <laughs> King Paisley, thank you, pal. Intellectual here was just insulting me regarding the Redskin. I did no such thing. <laughs> but, Mr. Lemieux, I suggested that all of us as Americans had a duty to take care of people living in this land, and that extends to Saint Denis. It ain't complex, Lemieux, and only an idiot like you, buddy, would try to make it so. I will not deny idiocy, so, but perhaps now is not the time. <laughs> Typical pansy. You are drunk, Ferdinand. <laughs> I'm not drunk, you fool. But this man, this man loves darkies. Hey, <laughs> you are pretty drunk. Yeah. What say you and me, cool off? <clears throat> Get your hands off me. Arthur's pissed. Come on, sleep it off. Sit down and calm down. Count to a thousand. Now you can rejoin the party. Thank you, sir. My pleasure. Henri Lemieux. I hope you're enjoying my party. The mayor. Allegedly. <laughs> There's quite a place you got here. <laughs> it's not mine, and the city is horribly in debt, but we can still put on a good show. Do you know Evelyn Miller? My lord. The writer? Well, we seem to have another deranged drunkard on our hands. Shall we? Fireworks? Oh, oh. oh. my lord, they're fantastic. Mr. Cornwall was quite insistent, I'm afraid. Uh, he shouted down the telephone for several minutes. Mr. Cornwall is a horse's ass and a bad horse. I'm very sorry, sir. It's not your fault. I'm a fool for trusting him. I'll come and sign it in a minute. Let me enjoy the fireworks. Of course. Please say something about Cornwall. Yes. Find out what. Sure. Remain undetected. I, I mess that up sometimes. <laughs> Ma'am? How do you do? Well secured. Good. Mr. Bronte has a habit of wandering about and reading whatever he likes. <laughs> We're watching him and his men like hawks. Thank you, Mr. Terrapin. Now, conveniently walk away. 
Great. <laughs> Lots of RP walking, yeah. Is everything taken care of? The telephone, it keeps ringing. The mayor said he will sign later. <sighs> Marie! Marie! Find that little reprobate chip and beat him! You will not have... I'm sorry, sir, but the party is in the garden. The residence is purely for family. I do hope you understand. Forgive me, I was unaware. Have standards slip in this house. Have you lost your mind? I said, have you lost your mind? Come here. Come here. Look at me. Look at me. Who do you think you are? This area is not meant for the likes of you, you know this. Standards in this house are slipping. This is a final warning to you, miss. A final Just warning. Just Astro, thank you for the three months. Now get out of my sight. Douchebag. That's it! Guards! Guards! We have an intruder! Whoops. <laughs> I figured I would have to confront him there. That was my mistake. Whoops. Please don't make me walk through that whole house again. Uh. Shoot. <laughs> my bad, guys. <laughs> 